if you do enjoy my FIFA content or you just love saying I'm shit at FIFA in the comments, then click the subscribe button down below. Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Today we are doing my favourite kits of the BPL this season. Um, if you want me to do more of these types of my favourite kits, if you want me to do it in like a different league like uh, the Bundesliga or La Liga. Um, but yeah, these are just my five favourite kits of the BPL. Um, there probably is more, but it was took it took so long to try and figure out which kits I actually really like. And there's probably a lot more than this, but um, and the the order might be different. But um, these are just kits I really like throughout the BPL this season. And what kits would be amazing to wear in uh, FIFA 16? So if we get started here on number five, we've got Arsenal's away kit. I think that's uh, the away kit. Um, this kit has got different angles by different angles i mean it looks nice and ugly in different in the different ways you see it um i saw this kit in sports i read and i looked up close and it looks so ugly the color looks so ugly it was like a mustard color and it looked so disgusting but from a distance it looks so like gold and amazing like as you see in this picture here is because it's got like the goldish uh, shiny diamond cut like shapes it looks so sick, but on the players, you can you see them from far. If you're watching them in a game from far away, you won't be able to see the diamonds. But you'll just see the goldish colour of the blue, and it looks so nice. So that's uh, my number five is Arsenal. But yeah, number four, you probably think I'm gonna be biased again, but the reason why I love this kit is because of what it says underneath their badge. It says the bowling ground from 1904 to 2016. This is going to be a kit that is going to be remembered because it's got the because uh, West Ham are moving to the Olympic Stadium next season um, and they're leaving the bowling ground, which is quite sad because they've been there the whole time they've been alive. The reason why I like this kit is because of that underneath the badge, and I've got the home kit. I was struggling to figure out which is going to be my favourite, their home kit or their away, but I think the away kit kind of wins it a bit because it's got two different colour blues. It's like got the light blue and then the stripe and then the top part of the kit is i don't know what you call that but it's like a pattern and uh, yeah but yeah that's number four um that's my four favorite kit and then we've got number three we've got newcastle's third kit i think this is their third kit i just love the way the blue and the white and the and the pink like just fits because you've got the pink on the edge of the sleeve and then you've got the pink half of the stripe is pink with the puma on it and then you've got half of it white and then you just got the wonga sponsor in the middle just fits perfectly somehow um it all fits into like the to the newcastle logo as well which looks really cool you see them on the players there looks pretty sick um and then they're, they're away kits all right but i think this one's their better kit um but yeah and then we go on number two this is the mad city away kit it looks sick um i think their original design was having like the water in the middle of the shirt like going across but it's actually on the sleeves now which looks so sick with the dark blue and the light blue just com like the combination just fits perfectly and you got um uh sterling in there just uh, modeling it in the other picture there which looks pretty sick um that's probably one of their best man city kits that they've had yeah um and number one this is my all-time favorite bpl kit this season it is the southampton away kit a lot of teams have actually got this these two uh, colors we got um swansea have actually got it i don't know uh, there's another team swansea have got uh, the same colors they've got it they've got it striped and it looks so sick um with that green and the navy blue just that it fits just so simple with the light green and then just the stripe of navy blue just going straight down um diagonally it looks so sick and you can see the players modeling it there that is uh, probably the kit i'm going to use next year in fifa 16 it's going to look so cool on the pitch but yeah these are my top five um bpl kits leave a comment down below what your favorite kit is this season in the bpl and if you want me to do more of these top five favorite kits uh, videos. So yeah, um, hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace guys.